Hi, Sang. How are you? Hi, teacher. I'm fine. Thank you. Um, so we did this the last time, but there were some words that you didn't understand. Um, no, I don't. Um, what words? No, I don't. Do you understand all of them? Yes. Okay. Um, then we go to the next one. I'm sorry, I've got a little bit of um, a flu. So I'm sorry if I'm sniffing. I have, I am not feeling very well. Okay. Let's go through these words. We've got house. House. Apartment. Apartment. Kitchen. Kitchen. Living room. Living room. Bedroom. Bedroom. Bathroom. Bathroom. Chimney. Chimney. Roof. Roof. Porch. Porch. Mailbox. Mailbox. Laundry room. Laundry room. Attic. Attic. Garden. Garden. Stairs. Stairs. Parking lot. Parking lot. Door. Door. Window. Window. Doorbell. Doorbell. Yard. Yard. And garage. 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 Do you know what all of these words mean? Um, I don't know. Attic. Okay. I'm going to draw. Do you know what that is? Mm, it is chimney. Yes. And this? It is, it is window. Yes. Now, the room, the room inside here is called an attic. Inside okay, the roof. I understand. Can you see? Yes. It's the room inside the roof. Okay, um, and you know this. Roof. Yes, very good. Do you know porch? Yes. Okay. Um, yard? Yes. Okay. So let's go to the next page then. Um, you can read and then tell me the answers. Um, one, a cover, cover on the top house. A cover on the top of a house. On the top of a house. Is roof. Yes, very good. Roof. A carry cover with grass around a, around a house. An area, an area. 
an area covered, 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 covered with grass around the house. Is yard, 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 yard. Number three. A set of one each floor of a large building. A set mm -hmm. of rooms. A set of rooms. Set of room. A set of room on each floor of a large building. A large building. Apartment. Very good. Yes, apartment. A room just below the roof of a house, um, attic. Yes, very good. Well done, attic. And the last one. Yes. A large flat pitch of wood, wood or glass that you open and close when you go into or out of a building. Is door. Yes, it is a door. A large flat piece. Piece. Piece of wood. Wood. Piece of wood, yes. Piece of wood. Next one. In, in big city, there are too many cars, but not enough. Uh, parking lot, parking lots. Very good, yes. Um, the baby woke up when the doorbell rang. Very good, well done. The newspaper delivery guy put the newspaper in our, our mailbox every morning. Well done. My dad fixes or was fixed car in the garage every weekend. Mom is doing the long laundry in the laundry room. Very good. Well done. You are doing great. Um, just these words. Remember to pronounce the s because in big cities there are too many cars. In big Cities, there are too many cars. I can only drive one car. Um, okay, yes. because more than one, it is cars. And only one, it's just a car. Car. Okay, so cars. Cars. But not enough. 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 You can. Enough. Yes. You spell it like this, but you can say it like that. Enough. Enough. Okay. The newspaper delivery guy puts, 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 put, put, puts, puts, puts. You have to say that. Otherwise, it sounds like you are saying 
um, cat in Dutch. They, they call a cat a puss. So the newspaper delivery guy, put, put. Yes, very good. My dad fixes. My dad fixes. Or washes. Or washes. His car. Very good. Okay. The next one. Okay. Some and any. We can use some for both countable plural nouns and uncountable nouns. We use some when we are not sure about the quantity of something, when we don't know how much. Okay? Yeah. So we can say countable, countable or uncountable. Uncountable. Okay. Yes. Okay, so there are some apples in the basket. I have some money in my pocket. You can count it or you're not sure. We can use any for both countable and uncountable nouns. Any is used in negative sentences and questions. Are there any eggs in the refrigerator? Yes, there are. No, there aren't any. Is there any pizza left? Yes, there is some on the table. No, there isn't any. Do you understand? Mm? Yes. Okay. Look at the pictures and check the correct sentences. Okay. What would you say? The boy is drinking some water or the boy is drinking any water? The boy is drinking some water. Yes, very good. There is some bread and cheese on the plate. There aren't any bread and cheese on the plate. Uh, there is some bread and cheese on the plate. Very good. Complete the conversations. Maya, can you help me with my science project? Sorry, but I don't have any time. Next one, you can read. Yes. Excuse me, Natalie. Do you have do you have any time to talk now? Sure. Jan Jamie, please come in. Which one do you think?
is not any. The correct answer is some. He will reply by saying, I don't have any time. Okay? The negative form. When you reply, negative sentences and questions. Okay? Do you understand? Yes. So because she can't, this is a negative. Sorry, but I don't have any time. Excuse me, Mr. Lee, do you have some time to talk now? Sure, Jamie, please come in. Do you understand the difference? Yes. Okay. Um, do you have some idea, idea why I am not? Um, do you have any idea why I am not? Yes, very good. Do you have any idea why I'm mad? Do you know why I'm mad? But when, um, let's say like this. Do you have any idea why I'm mad? But when you ask me, If I know why your friend is mad, I can say I have no Does it make sense to you? Mm. Oh, I have, I have, sorry. Yeah? Yes. Okay. Did I take a picture now? Okay. Part one. Read the hints and circle the best answers. Yes. Um, it is a room in a house. You can cook food here. See a kitchen. It is usually next next to or attached to a house. You can keep your car in it. It's a a garage. A garage. A garage. A garage. 
It is a bit that less smoke pass how a building up into the air. See a chimney. Yeah, it's so, very good. Well done. It is a box and it is usually outside a house. Now carrier put letters in this box. B a mail a mailbox. A mailbox, yes, very good. Okay. It is usually next to or attached. 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 Pipe. 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 Very good. Okay. Um, look at the floor plan, then answer questions one, two, three. Um, how many bedrooms are there? Uh, there are two bedroom. Uh, bedroom. There are two bedroom in a in the house in a house. Oh, sorry. Only two. There are two bedroom in a house. What's this? Master bedroom. And this? Master bathroom. And this? Bedroom. So how many bedrooms are there? Uh, it's only one bedroom. Son, bedroom. How many bedrooms? There, there are eight, one. There is a bedroom. Oh, this is a bathroom. Sorry. There are two B. Two bedrooms. Yes, very good. Where is the laundry room? It, uh, it is near to the bathroom. Hey. Very good. Which is the biggest area? C, um, the living room. Very good. Well done. <clears throat> okay. Um, you can read this one for me. Read the letter, then answer questions four to five. Um, yes, Susan. Susan, I'm going to stay in Miami. 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 Miami during the summer vacation. I found a lovely, lovely beach house near near Miami Beach. Miami. 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 Miami Beach is hard. To Three bedrooms, four bathroom, bathrooms, a dining room, a kitchen, and a garage. Garage. I rented it for two months. So I. So if you haven't set up, set set up any class yet, you are more than welcome to stay with me. Talk to you later. Sincerely. Number four. Where, where is the beach house? Uh, B, near Miami Beach. Very good. How long did Jennifer stay at the beach, at the beach house? C, for two months. Very good. Well done. You are doing great. Some more. Uh, some more reading. Read the text and answer questions six to eight. Yes. 
What does the word house mean to you? A house is a shelter for people to live in. It protects us from danger and bad weather. We do many things in a house. We eat, wash, sleep, and rest there. A house, a house also provides wonderful memories for each family. Look around your room. You might find being a mark on the world that shows, shows how much you have around. Or some coffee stays on the carpet. When you visit your friend's house, next time, try to think a story lies up around the house. So, what is that about? A. The meaning of house. This statement is not true about house. Which statement is not true? Uh, see, we can do many things there. What can we do in a house? See, like kind. Yes, very good. That will be impossible. Okay. Read the story about Judy and her mom, then answer questions 9 to 12. Mm. Sorry. Judy walked, walked into the kitchen and asked her mom for him. Asked, asked, asked and asked, walked. Walked. Walked, asked her mom for help. Mom can you help me with my homework? What's the homework about? Judy, Judy's mom asked. I had to write down five things in I five things I do in my house, but I can't think of any. Judy replied. Judy, Judy's mom looked surprised. And ask, what do you mean? We do many things in the house. We do. Judy asked, sure. First, what are you doing now? Judy mom asked, I'm trying to do my homework in the living room. Judy replied, well, that one, that's one thing. And what am I doing now? Judy mom asked again, you are prepare, preparing dinner. That's correct. That's correct. Now think about what we do in the each room. Said the mom. Judy put carefully for a minute. Well, I sleep in my bedroom, eat in the kitchen, watch TV in the living room, and take a shower in the bathroom. Judy answered, I think you have just finished your homework. Judy's mom said with a smile. Wow, you are right. I just need to write this down in the notebook. Time is more. Judy said, you are well welcome. Judy's mom replied, Mom, I don't need my homework now. Can I have a cookie? Judy asked, no, you are going to have a dinner in the meeting. Go wash the hand, answer with her mom. Um, Dad, who does, who does Judy ask for help? See her mom. 
What is Julie's mom doing? She making dinner. What does Judy want after the she finishes her homework? D a cookie. When is Judy have to have? When is Judy going to have dinner? B in a fifteen minutes. Very good. Well done. Okay, just again, Judy walked. Walked. And asked. Ask. She just finished. Finish. Finished. Finished. Yes, she finished her homework. Oh, wow. 65. Okay. Oh my goodness. I'm so sorry. My nose is blocked. We're just going to carry on to the next one. Are you happy with the previous lesson now? Yes. You understand? Yes. Okay. So let's look at these words. Bank. Bank. Bank teller. Bank teller. Let's do this. I'm going to do it word for word. Bank. Bank. Yes. And bank teller. Bank yes. is the building. Bank teller is the person that works at the bank. Yeah. Account. 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 Account number. Account number. Okay. You have a bank account. And every account has an account number. Yeah. Safe deposit <coughs> box. Safe deposit box. Security guard. Security guard. ATM. ATM. Cash. Cash. Credit card. Credit card. Bank book. Bank book. Safe deposit box. Yes. Security card. I don't know if there will be a um do you know what an ATM is? Yes. Okay. So we don't have to. Um, you know what cash is? Mm, no, I don't. Cash. Yes. Credit card. <clears throat> Bank book. Bank book. Then we have check. Check. Interest. Interest. Deposit. Deposit. Withdraw. Withdraw. And balance. Balance. Okay. Check. But I think because they, they've got two different spellings, you've got the English, the British way of spelling it, and you've got the American. Yes. 